guys welcome back to my channel Kinsella here and in today's video I actually have a review for you guys I know I made a lot of video on my channel unboxing things but I've never actually sat down to make a review video for you guys so I'm gonna be reviewing a jewelry brand the jewelry brand is called Miss Soma and they are based in the UK and they are making demi fine jewelry you know demi fine jewelry it means that their style their design is somewhere between fashion forward and very fine luxurious jewelry so that creates the whole category of demi fine jewelry You are one of those persons who have to like do a lot of research when you are trying to find new pieces for your collection maybe you're just curious about this brand if you are curious then stick around for the rest of the video and if you do like this video don't forget to like share and give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't already thank you guys so much who are already subscribers for watching this video let's get right into the nitty-gritty of this brand so we're talking about Miss Oma, a sustainable jewelry brand they have been around for more than a decade they started in 2008 and they have created fantastic jewelry lines since then if you browse their website i think everybody can agree that you get a woman empowerment vibe from looking and browsing their website uh, you could see lots of women modeling the pieces lots of collaboration with other women lots of community work with other women and and that's one of the reasons why i decided to purchase uh, jewelry from misoma i did actually get a few pieces from their collection some of these pieces are gold plated verme and some of these other pieces are 18 karat gold i will explain to you what the differences are between gold plated verme and gold plated first i want to talk about misoma and their sustainable mission so their mission is actually to create pieces that can be worn every single day and because of that they use quality craftsmanship and most of their jewelry are made in India and also in Thailand they hand selected these factories themselves because they believe in quality work that is actually not damaging the environment and hence the sustainability and they also make sure that these pieces that they create are very luxurious they ship to 200 different countries so far and they also have collaborative work with other women with factories with other communities all over the world and i will show you some of what they have been doing misoma is a member of the responsible jewelry council and what that means is that they follow a charter of best practices one of them is that they make sure the people and the environment is totally safe whatever they're doing does not affect the environment in a negative way they also make sure that international conventions and industry labor laws and other kinds of laws are actually being met they also make sure that the working conditions of everyone that works for misoma and helps to create these beautiful pieces are actually great one of their program is the tree sister program now if you have purchased some items like during black friday then it means that you would have contributed to this program tree sister charity is actually headed by a woman and if you have purchased then some of your money would have been donated to replanting a tree and that would actually help them planting a million trees by 2026. Misoma also partners with artists. Misoma has this Mompocino collection that is inspired by local Colombian women. They have this workshop where local women who are artists can actually help to create pieces that inspire other women all around the world. And I think that's just one of the great initiatives that they have taken and that's really good. Their packaging is also 100% recyclable so they are really concerned about the environment and about empowering women and about making a mark in the world as a whole one of the fascinating programs is the change a girl life campaign which they have this artist her name is Maya Mubedin and she created some pieces that were used to create some misoma collection pieces they are helping young girls to express themselves and in turn these pieces of 
very important self expressions are being bought and sold all over the world and that's just amazing Aya created the pendant of power she also created the gold chalice pendant which is a pendant of femininity the trust yourself pendant which is actually one of wisdom and actually helps to empower you as a woman chalcedony there's a powerful pendant semi precious stone is said to remove self-doubt and build self-confidence so these are just some of the pieces that were created and then you can meet the artist here at the bottom of the page this is maya all of these pieces are well thought about so meaningful and they have like this amazing art history behind every single piece now i want to talk about two pieces that i got that are gold plated these gold plated necklaces are plated on top of base materials such as brass or copper and actually like 0.05% of gold that is used to create gold plated pieces gold itself won't tarnish but the base material like the copper or the brass will actually tarnish so you have to be careful when wearing gold plated pieces and you do not want to wear gold plated pieces like in the shower because any kind of chemicals or liquids can actually help to tarnish and reduce the life of your jewelry collection you have to use a non-abrasive cloth to actually clean your jewelry pieces that are gold plated if you want to have them for a very long time because these pieces are a little expensive this is the camille snake chain necklace and this is the Altamon chain necklace and this one is 500 milliliters in length and then you take your claw out to the adjustment part of the necklace so this is really cool and this one is a 435 millimeters in length this one was like 239 US dollars and this one was 232 US dollars so that's it for gold plated jewelry now I'm going to show you some other pieces that are gold vame type jewelry all the other pieces I got are gold plated vame gold plated vame means that a thicker piece of gold is plated onto stone and silver about 2.5 microns of gold it will not tarnish and it is actually a longer lasting piece of jewelry to have in your collection I got the chokers and these chokers are about 310 millimeters long and when it's extended it's about 380 um, this one is amazonite and this one is malachite amazonite is one of those gemstones that is the talisman of truth and hope this gemstone was actually used uh, many many years ago in egyptian history to protect the amazonian princess and then we have the malachite which is the one that absorbs all the good energies and knowledge from the earth and it has a lot of wisdom in it this stone actually helps you with the transformations you are about to prune your branches and say yes to new growth then yeah malachite is the stone that will help you to do that so this one has amazing powers yes many greeks and egyptians usually use these stones and it is mined in also egypt and different countries all over the world so this is actually one of those stones that you can wear that will help you with your transformation and your life the last two pieces are my double chain um, bracelets all these pieces are 18 carat the gold is a uh, verme they are gold plated on stone and silver and that means it has higher quality a lot more gold in them they won't tarnish and they will actually last a very long time you just got to do the same cleaning process like you would with other jewelry keep them in cool dry places and use that non-abrasive cloth to actually keep them shiny and nice um, these ones are about 160 millimeters long um, these necklaces like I mentioned before they are 380 millimeters long the necklaces are a little bit more pricey this Lena charm choker is hundred and forty three US dollars and this malachite choker is 103 US dollars um, they are the same length 380 millimeters um, when extended out to the very end of the necklace 
So the continuous extension is 380 when extended fully the last little piece right here. These double chain bracelets are 180 US dollars and they are 165 millimeters but when they're extended it's 185 so that gives you some added length to your bracelet so that's really cool. They're also vermeil, 18 karat gold vermeil. You could possibly do a lot of work in these and they will not tarnish. These last way longer than any gold plated jewelry that is gold plated on brass or on copper so yeah if you're looking to get things that last longer then 18 karat gold vermeil is actually a great choice gold has so many different types and sometimes you can get frustrated if you are searching for something that is high quality sustainable and also affordable i hope this video actually helps you guys when you are choosing your jewelry i will show you how i layer my pieces <laughs> I made sure I got me some really nice pieces because I do resonate with the brand. I believe in their mission and I also like what they stand for. And not only do I get some really vibrant, creative, beautiful pieces, but I also get to contribute to their community work and that resonates with me deeply. And that's one of the reasons why I shop with them. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll catch you guys in the next